Yo, I ain't here for the money, I ain't here for the fame Though it might be nice to own a jet plane I'm What is going on guys, my name is 4G and today I'm going to be talking about the brand new week 3 challenges That were actually leaked today Alright, so I'm just going to get right into it, I'm going to do it quickly I'm not going to bore you guys, alright, so let's get into it so first of all, really quickly, <laughs> this information is coming from CrossLeaks over on Twitter. So as you can see by the watermark on this image, that is um, who it came from. But let's get into it. I'm going to discuss it and what each thing could possibly mean. All right. So revive a player in different matches. That's obvious. All right. Don't need to um, don't need to make a whole discussion video on that. Um, but search chest and lonely lodge. That is pretty easy. I don't like how they're bringing back the chest challenges again, but. Uh, at least it's not the old ones where it's like seven challenges all at once. I don't like that whatsoever. Seven chests, I mean, not seven challenges. Um, uh, of course, that's just stage one, so it's probably going to be search a chest in Lonely Lodge, of course, and then search a chest somewhere else, and then so on and so on until you finish it completely. So the next one, ring the doorbell of a house with an opponent inside. Okay, so... I don't know what that means exactly. How are we going to ring a doorbell in Fortnite? I'm sure they're going to implement something that allows us to do that. Um, I think that's going to be pretty cool. Pretty uh, pretty weird <laughs> compared to what we're used to, you know, with Fortnite. But still, I think that's pretty cool. I like how they're adding new things into the game because they're obviously going to do this, adding a doorbell into Fortnite. Uh, this is going to be pretty easy, though. It is going to be easy. It says hard, but um, I think all you would really have to do is land in, drop down, see that someone drops on a house go to the front door hold square or f or whatever the button is to ring the doorbell or however you ring it hit it with that pickaxe i don't know what it is but either way however you ring the doorbell you just do that when someone lands on the house there you go you got your challenge is complete well you have to do it five times but you know what i mean um so that seems pretty easy seems uh seems like it's fun though because it's different anyways on to the next thing stage one this, these are the premium challenges by the way um visit risky reels and wailing woods in a single match that's pretty easy because they're right next to each other um but of course that's stage one there's other stages that we have to complete with that so i'm sure it's going to be like the next one going to be like visit shifty shafts and tilted towers in the same match because that's pretty easy so i'm sure that might be one uh, because they're right next to each other all right so next hit a player with a tomato 20 meters away or more so now that we like more people have unlocked the tomato and things like that uh they're starting to use that as a challenge you know because that's what they did uh last season season five with the golf clubs and everything you actually had to play golf to get that challenge done or the basketball one where you actually have to shoot some hoops to actually get that done which is pretty cool i like how they're implementing that all right, so next, shoot three targets at different shooting galleries. I don't know what shooting galleries they're talking about, but I think that is pretty cool. Hopefully, they're, I think they're going to add something, unless there already is shooting galleries, and I just can't think of it right this second. But either way, on to the next thing. Eliminate an opponent in different matches, and that you have to complete ten times. That's not hard. That's just kind of tedious. In a good way, though, because it's actually challenging, you know, eliminating an opponent in different matches. So, anyways, guys, that was the week three challenges that we're going to be seeing this Thursday, October 11th. And, um, yeah, what do you guys think about these? Are you guys excited to be able to complete your challenges and get further along in your battle pass? Because, um, yeah, I'm very excited to get the XP from this. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed, hit the like button down below. And, of course, subscribe for more awesome daily Fortnite content such as this. I post things like this daily. And, uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Have a great day.